Sorry about the repeat of the shirt, but I'm just so flipping tired. <laughs> <laughs> it was a nice weekend. It was a long weekend, but uh, we're, we're glad to be home in our own chair, in our own dwellings, in our own beds. Everything's going to be so much nicer. Uh, today I'm going to talk about adversity, which is the struggle against things in life that don't exactly go your way. I love my family. We had a really good time. But as in all families, there's a reason why you all have your own homes. Everybody is situated in their own little fairyland, I guess. And they do things their own way. We love each other. We get along with each other. But we're not made to be together. 24-7 <laughs> and I hate that expression but we were literally together 24-7 and uh, we did have a good time but there were moments that you know people clashed and that's just what happens and that's just who we are and like in our family we agree to disagree and so some would go off this way and some would go off that way but unfortunately at night we'd all have to come back together and uh, that's just what happened so but it was a good weekend the kids had a lot of fun uh, the water, I wished it was a little cleaner looking. I might have gone in it. Might have. I don't know that I would have definitely gone in it. But uh, but today's my birthday. <laughs> so that made it really good. I dreamt last night that everybody forgot my birthday. And that when I got up and went for my walk, which by the way, I had to walk by myself because somebody didn't want to walk with me today. Oh, it's not that I didn't want to. Well, she just wanted to pack up. <laughs> I wanted to be home. <laughs> because last night, the the candle had burned at both ends. And it was... <laughs> boom! We had fireworks. So, and it's not like on hate that we had fireworks. It's just out of sheer love. <laughs> because if it was hate, weapons would have been drawn. <laughs> but there was no weapons. No. There were knives, but I stayed clear of them. But um, So we had, a, we had a good time. But anyway, like I said, the, everybody... if. The where we went was like a three and a half hour trip. So if we would have been like within an hour of where we were supposed to go, oh, I don't have a doubt. I, my sister Mary and I would have been the only ones left in the cabin because everybody else would have packed up and gone. They would have been <laughs> gone. So uh, we we stayed there and we had we had a good time. But like I said, when I went for my walk, I come back and the whole cabin's all packed. Oh, I had packed most of my stuff the night before. I didn't have that much, but uh, the whole cabin was ready and we were like doing our bathroom runs and then we were out the door and that was that was where we were going to go but even with all the adversity and with all the problems that we had i went ahead and booked us for next year but uh, this time i got us four cabins like shannon was telling us that there was 18 people in a cabin <laughs> there wasn't really 18 but there was 10 <laughs> and i would say that was probably about Ten too many, because <laughs> it was, you know, I had my own bed, so I didn't care. And like I said, I can sleep anywhere, and I sleep good. I wake up a lot at night anyhow, it's just part of being old. But, uh, so I, it was just, so I booked us four cabins, so everybody will have their own cabin next year. So when we do get tired of each other, we can go into our own cabins. But I don't see that happening. I, th I think we're going to have a good time. And it's an hour away, so if everyone gets pissed, they can get in their car and they can leave. But, uh... To, like I said, today is my birthday, and my friend Jeff, which I had told you about originally, my friend that uh, we have comments, sent me. I had to go to the bathroom so bad. I forgot and took my water pill before we left, and I had to pee so bad. And just as we pulled into the rest stop, which I didn't think I was going to make it into the bathroom, I had to go that bad. I got a text from him, which I knew was for my birthday, but I thought, I'm going to wait because i got to go to the bathroom. Thank God I did. Because I laughed so hard when I got his text about my birthday that I would have literally peed my pants. And the way the car was packed, I would have had to drive home and pee pants. And, and that would not have been happening. But anyway, he sent me two dinosaurs. And he said, happy birthday, your friend said to say hi. <laughs> like he's insinuating I'm old because he is so much younger than me. But, you know, damn, I'm not that old. Yeah, I'm old. But, uh, so I, like I've said, I, I... You haven't told them how old you are. Oh, I'm 65. Mm. I told them before I was going to be 65. I know, but some day, people but, might not have. Oh, that's true. I'm 65. I got my Medicare card. It made me feel old. But uh, I was very diligent. You saw my salads. I was very diligent on my eating. I was very picky about what I ate. 
And I got home and I lost two pounds. So I'm creeping up on Denise because now I've lost 24 and a half, I think. I've got 24 and a half pounds I've lost. So I'm, I'm on my journey. I'm, I'm going to be doing it even if i got to walk alone. But um, Oh, that sounded so sad. Well, it was so sad. How often have you had to walk alone? I had to walk alone in the, the desolate country. <laughs> It was like anybody could have grabbed me. We had to walk by woods. Somebody could have snatched me. Of course, they would have thrown me back like a bad fish. Uh, put her back. She's that worth keeping. But uh, but anyway, I, I had a good time. I lost my two pounds, that which was very happy. I have come to the conclusion that I can't just diet. I have to exercise too. So I do have to walk. And I, and I do know that Denise was a little more anxious to get home than me. But... <laughs> That's, as was my daughter, a little more anxious to get home than me. But uh, we, like I said, family is family, and if you can't tell, if you can't put up with your own family, that's just the way it's going to go. But uh, my quote this week is from Helen Keller, who said, "If there was, I can't see, I can't." See. No, sorry. Oh, is that what? No. <laughs> <laughs> that was just not right. Me. <laughs> she can't hear. Me. <laughs> Oh, I would have said that. I'm old enough to know. That I'm that sorry. That's made me forget what she was going to say. What, what oh, she says that if there was only joy in the world, we would never learn patience, which was very true because we needed a ton of patience this weekend. But, uh, you know, we all made it home alive with no scars or bruises and... We'll, we'll do it again, <laughs> but I am very thankful that I decided to do my birthday on Friday because if we were all together today to do my birthday and sing happy birthday, I'd be getting happy birthday to you. <laughs> Eat the damn cake. Let's go. <laughs> so it'll be a more joyous occasion on Friday. So once again, I lost two pounds. Um, shout out to all my friends. Like I'm a celebrity. <laughs> My family who watches from out of town. So I just I'm just so happy to be alive. I'm so happy I have another year to live, at least, <laugh�> till my next birthday. And I will be 100 pounds lighter by my next birthday. I do not have a doubt of that. I do not have a doubt. Thanks to Denise and thanks to all of you, I will. So until next week, here's looking at you. <laughs> And what do you have to say? Oh, and I have to say, <laughs> like us, subscribe, and share comment. It. We do like and share it with people. You know, like I, I have no problems if people think I'm a goofball. It's just like I said, who cares? Whatever, I don't care. It's just that's who I am. I have enough family and friends that love and adore me, and who I love and adore, and uh, if that's all. I'm just richer for it in my life. It's just. It's the best present I can have is my family and my friends. I could never ask for anything more. So. Oh, she's going to start to cry. I'm going to start to cry. I can say I'm on my birthday. I really do. You think about your all your life that's passed by. I just, I just think I was young. I still think I'm young, but it's just, it's going by too quick. I really, realistically, really only have another 20 years to go. Oh, it's my like, God. I'm modeling here now. It's just, <laughs> that's sad. 65 has gone by like that. Can you imagine how fast 20 is going to go? Oh. It's like, oh, my gosh. Oh. You won't know it, but, though. But somewhere in my next life, I better have better teeth because I can't stand. That's the only thing I don't like looking at the video. I could care about this big old body, but my teeth, they bother me. There's but, always something in a person that they don't like. Yeah, but it's my teeth. I have, somebody, I have a baby tooth. I'm always going to be young because <laughs> I have a baby tooth. So I'm like, I'm done. I'm done. I'm rambling now. So see you next week.